Hi everyone, it's Al. Got another review today. Uh, this one is the, the Dyson Animal, um, and it's a nice little light tool. Uh, it's quite expensive, um, but it is a good tool. Um, this is one of those with all the cyclone jets around the top there. You've probably seen the advert for it. Uh, I'm going to do a proper home test of this one though. Okay, um, we've got a filter in here. I'll just click the filter thing back for you so you can see it. Uh, click it up there. And there's the filter in there, you can see it. And all the dust in there because we've been using it. Okay, so we'll clamp that back on. Um, remove all the rubbish, you push this button here. Okay, and it pops out the end. And uh, you can clean it all out in there. You can see all the rubbish, that's fairly straightforward. Um, the battery is part of the unit, it doesn't come away separately. Um, and the power supply goes on the end of there. Um, now then, the actual noise of the machine, pretty good I think. I'll put it on and you can see. Um, I'll put it on max. That's maximum. Okay. And then we'll put it to power speed. Uh, and that's not so noisy at all. Uh, to me this is fairly quiet. I've got a G-Tech Hoover I've done a review on already and it is twice the loudness of that. That's maximum again. Alright, so I think it's it's pretty good for noise personally. Um, but the good thing with this one is, of course, you've got the attachment. So I've got the mirror on the floor. Um, I'm going to put the pole on, this first pole on. Um, it's got a good good array of attachments. They just clonk on like so. Uh, and then you get the one you want on here. I'll show you this one for the stairs first. Uh, and this one, it slides up and down to, uh, with a hair. So I think it's just to show you. There you go. Um, and it's good because it will brush the dirt into the hoover itself. So we're going to stick this one in first and show you how this one goes. Let's see if I can get it around the right way first now. That's it. Get them right. That's it. Get it around the right way with a flat piece there. Okay, so we'll just try getting some stuff off the there here. Okay, good little tool that one, and you can see how much hair has got in there. There you are. Um, a lot of it collects around the brush here, but it's good because it does pull it all in. I mean, you can pull the loose off anyway afterwards. Just pull it off and chuck it in a bin. So I'll bung that down there. Okay, so that's that little attachment. I'll take him out. Um, this one is, is more for your floors and carpets, etc. And this one is the all flexi thingy wobbly one. The wobbly wobbly one. <laughs> I call it the wibbly wobbly one, I think. Okay, so we'll stick this one in now and um, we'll show you how this one goes. And let's get it around the right way out. And you'll hear it clicking. Okay, it's sort of like it looks a bit, bit of a funny thing at first, but you get used to it. It will find its own way properly. Now, as you can see, the only shortcoming here is probably all this hair. Look, you know, it really collects in the in the rollers badly. Um, and as soon as it's for pet hair, this this Hoover, uh, it's not very good. You've got to keep this clean all the time. And if you look at this, now the problems you can see is here is that one of the, the bars, the actual looks of rubber that are supposed to go on this have come off already um, and there was another one across here, a blue strip going right across it's come away already, it's gone, we've had this six months so that's not very good really that that's gone uh, and that one's gone, I mean there's one gone out of there um, so this attachment you know should be better I think and you know obviously not as good as it should be but it is still working so we'll carry on with it i mean it's still okay but i just think these things are weaknesses uh, need sorting out i think uh, dyson ought to get on that one so we'll just do a bit of floor now it down there. you can see i think it's pretty quiet i don't think it makes a lot of noise it's still fairly quiet and then Smooth and easy to work with. Okay. okay, I'm just going to do the stairs um, again with the, the little brush bit pulled back. Okay, so that the hairs don't get stuck around there, just so you can see again. Um, I haven't done up this far, so we go up. You see the hair looks being pulled across. Yeah. Oh, that's been blown away. So it does that. So just the wind of the motor. 
That's because I haven't got the arm on it, you see, and the air's coming out the back. And it will go, if you had the long arm on. There we go, we'll put it in, there we go. Way, get up there, man, lad. Just, yeah, and I can see this. The man, hoovering, rarity. Okay, so that's that one. Just going to show you the one of the fabrics now. Right, just to show you the um, the fabric bit now, the uh, the old settee, dog sat on the settee, we're going to give it a little bit. That's pretty good. So a good suction there. You see the suction on it. Very, very good. You'll have no problem with that. It does a grand job. Um, and that's about it for those tools. But so that's the problem i think is that here there we've got a dog and uh, that's what you get you've got to keep that pretty much clear but it does get wrapped up pretty badly okay last attachment i'll show you that one is this one um, and this one doesn't take for pet hair i think it's actually probably better actually um this one has got, again, it's got plenty of hair in there, again, where we've picked up dog hair, um, but the, the rubber's still intact, that should be on the other one, still going across there at the moment, so that one's okay. Um, and this one revolves lovely. I mean, if I show you before I put it on the floor, you'll see that it, it does sort of power around. You can see that moving. So it does pull everything up nicely, you know, so it's really good for a quick, you know, furnishings and stuff like that. It's probably better with this one, especially for your car, you know, you can get in. Uh, a lot of pull on that. If I pull that on the floor, it's got a lot of pull back. It's got that really sucking to that floor. It's really got the suck. If you go around to the dog here, you can just around the other floor. See if we can get all that in there. It goes. It's all gone in. There you go. You can see that there. It's all gone up there. Yeah. And I'll show you the other one. So, all in all, I think still a very good tool, but there you can see where that hair's collected on there. Um, but otherwise, apart from these few shortcomings, um, I think it's pretty good buy. Um, yeah, would I recommend it? Yeah, I'd say buy. <laughs> okay, that's about it from me. Um, that's the Dyson Animal. And um, thanks very much for watching all my videos, Derrick and 33. Look at them on my channel. Thanks very much for watching. Bye. -bye.